Hello everybody, I'm Sharp and Blade, and today I have another unboxing video. This time, it's from Integrity Knives. I'm gonna leave this here. Now, as I open this, I'll give you my spiel. <laughs> you can use discount code Sharp and Blade at Integrity Knives website or on their website to receive 10% off the purchase of a knife or anything. So, um, the discount code just doesn't work on um, Vero knives or Pena knives. But, anyways, pretty much everything else is a go. I'm gonna open it up here. Now I'm using these small Arian to open this. Now, <laughs> yeah, you guessed it. More Savivis. <laughs> and another sticker. Oh, I don't need to double up the stickers, so that's good. I'll keep that just in case. My dog sometimes likes to eat stickers, so it's good to have a spare. Now, um, so we've got the Elementum and Dark Green Micarta and another one. <laughs> I'll leave that for a second, and I figured it was time to get a, an, an Elementum. Um, I've experienced a few over the months that they, it's been out, and I figured now is a good time to have one, because there's all kinds of Elementums coming out, different variations and stuff. So, uh, you got your sticker, you got your sticker. Got your paperwork, got your cleaning cloth, you got your knife, <laughs> and you got your pouch. Okay, so this is the knife now. Yeah, I like, here, I'm gonna get some light, some better light here. Need some of this stuff. Mm -hmm, put that there. Bring some light over here. There we go. All right. So this is the Elementum. Ah. In the dark green micarta. Some black hardware. Deep carry clip. Very nice. Okay, let's see what it's, what's the action like on it. Oh, very nice. I don't remember if I flipped, I think I flipped, I had gotten this in uh, last year for a giveaway. I didn't review it or anything. I didn't really even touch it too much because I didn't want to do anything to it. <laughs> so I don't remember if I flipped it that much, but yeah, this is a really nice action. It's going to break in nicely. Yeah, I like that. Should be nice and slicey. So the reason why I got this now is because of this knife. I figured it'd be nice to have a comparison. I should have a comparison if I'm gonna have this one. That's enough to, oh yeah, that's enough. So this is another Civivi. <laughs> and this is, again, all the stickers and crap. This is the Button Lock Civivi Elementum. So, okay, now, huh. I don't know, I'm scared to flip this open because I know, because like it's locked shut, you gotta press the button to open it and some people didn't like that. Um, I don't know how I'm gonna like this or not, but there's only one way to find out. Uh, people are saying like it looks looks kind of aggressive. I don't know. You tell me, does this look aggressive? <laughs> oh, 
I don't know. I'd be afraid. <laughs> but uh, no, I don't know. I think you get used to it. It's uh, smooth. So right now I can move freely because it's not locked in place yet. There, it's locked. No, it's solid. There's no blade play whatsoever. That is solid. And then it just moves freely. I'll have to mess around with that. I mean, it's not that bad. I could see myself getting used to that. It just, it might look a little, a little aggressive. <laughs> as far as, you know, whipping that out in front of people that aren't used to knives. But, uh, I don't know. It's, it's not that bad, really. Um, right off, first impressions, I think they could have done a better job with this. Uh, I just, I don't know. It's... I don't know. Uh, it's hard to say. First impressions on this probably aren't really fair. You gotta get, you gotta get used to it. So, anyways, I'll, I'll mess around with it. I'll see what I think. But, we'll start with the comparisons already. You can see, actually, it'd probably be easier to hold up like this. You can see, longer blade, for sure. And, longer handle, too. So, this is a much nicer size. Uh, this is fine for EDC, but this size is pretty much perfect for me. And, you know, it would be cool if it was a liner lock with a flipper, maybe? <laughs> anyway, it, it is it is nice. Uh, like, this right here is nice. I like that. The action on the clothes is nice. Although, it's bothering my thumb a little bit. It's just, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I'm not sure. But uh, anyways, it's... I don't know. We will see. It's different. It's different. And I would have liked to have gotten a different version of this. But this is all Integrity Knives head at the moment. I'm sure they'll get different versions in at some point. But I figured since it's such an aggressive opening method, it might as well look kind of aggressive too, right? So... <laughs> But uh, anyways, yeah, so, I don't know, I, I kind of I kind of like it a little bit. I just, I think they could have done a little bit better job with the button. It's just, it feels, I, I don't know what it is about it, but I just, I don't really like the button. Um, but anyway, we'll see how it goes. So, sharpened blade from the future here, and I figured I uh, would throw this in here. I've been messing around with it a little bit. And, uh, I kind of like the, um, uh, I kind of like this, actually. I like the action on it. Would it be nice if it had a flipper? Yeah. But, uh, you know, it doesn't really work well with the whole locking button lock thing. But, it is nice that you can just do this. And then it, it shuts. Because a lot of the times when you get a button lock, it goes, you know what I mean? Like when you shut it, it bounces a little bit. And then you got to kind of you gotta push it or whatever you flick it. This, you can just drop it and then you let go of the lock and it just locks it in place. I, I actually, I like this <laughs> a lot more than I thought I would. Um, yeah. It's actually really fun. Uh, it is, you know... <laughs> It is hard on the thumb, but I'm sure my thumb will get used to that. But yeah, I just wanted to throw this in there saying that it is actually growing on me quite a bit. It is a fun action, so hey, that's that's cool. Like I say, there will be a link to Integrity Knives Web. Wait a second. Yeah, that is smaller. <laughs> that, I just like, that, the little Sabibi logo looks way too small on here. <laughs> It looks really weird, but I'm sure they had to make the pivot a little bit smaller maybe because of the button lock. But that does look really small and awkward. <laughs> but anyways, that's just a little nitpick there that I just noticed. But um, anywho, like I was about to say, I will leave a link to Integrity Knives website in the in the description of this video. Be sure to use to be sure to check them out and use discount code SharpenBlade for 10% off your purchase.
Thanks so much for watching. Take care.